it's an evening. And Spike's on duty in the unmarked car he calls Black Beauty. We've just had a report of two cars in Pingley, which is uh, the, the main town nearest to where we are, um, performing donuts on the main road. Uh, someone's obviously heard this and they've got some cause for concern. Spike's an advanced driver. He can handle a fast car, but he's seen too many drivers lose it doing dumb tricks like donuts. We need to get there uh, and, and prevent any kind of crash from happening, or worse. The suspect vehicle's two silver cars were spotted five miles away. One of the added bonuses of us being in Black Beauty tonight, um, it's got all the same equipment of a normal traffic car, but once we get close to where a scene like this has happened, we'll just revert back to being covert. As he approaches the area where the silver cars were spotted, Spike kills the siren. I don't want people to actually hear us coming, but clearly I need to be able to move people out of the way safely, so that's what we're doing at the minute. Finally, it's off with the blues and into full stealth mode. This is the road where it was uh, reported to be happening. Um, so I'm just having a look now, uh, see if someone is still lurking by. Um, if they're not, it's then where they have moved on to. There's no sign of silver cars doing donuts, but something else sets off Spike's spider sense. Two youngsters parked up. Come on, old chap. Hi. Hi, mate, you alright? Yeah. What's up, mate? Just took my off now. Well, I'll... I don't know. It's alright then. Hey, mate. Uh, is this your water? Yeah, no, it's a system, mate. All oh, right. You allowed to drive us? Pardon? You allowed to drive us? Shut down, mate. Waiting for it. Apparently, the guy's sister is due any minute to legally drive them away, which raises a question. Who's just driven it here? Sister. Because the back wheels of the car are really warm. Oh, man. Yeah, it's only just been driven yeah. now. Oh yeah, it's to the point where the actual discs are that off. Their story holds water like an old sieve, and Spike's about to poke another hole in the absent sister defence. Let me just have a look here, mate. Because if there's been somebody else in this, there's actually not room for you guys to be in the back. What do you mean? There's nowhere for you to have been sitting in the back. My oh, sister's right. gone down, mate, to get switched away. I've just so sold a dog to some lads. Have you? Yeah, mate, I'll show you pictures. I'll show you. The plot thickens. The back seats apparently contain the dog, which they've just sold. I sold a dog. Right. I'm not lying to you, mate. So there's been a dog in the back, has there? Yes. Look, I'm parked up back on my white pickup. I yeah. Are you fine? No problem, mate. See you soon. Right up. We'll wait for your sister to come back and to make sure with her neck. This could be a long wait. Your sister's gone where? I've just been sold it up. No, look, that's not good. Shop, please. Is it? Yeah. As luck would have it, that may be the dog they've just sold. Come here, sir. Do the corner where? Hi, lad, George. Have you just bought this dog? Who off? <laughs> Who else was with them? Just the two of them. Anyone else? Right on, two men. The Shaggy Dog story rings true, but Rover's new owner saw no sign of the sister who supposedly drove the car here. The story checks out, they've just bought the dog off you. Um, the drama being they say there was only ever use to here. Hello? Yeah, because we've come and they come afterwards. All right. Time for another little poke at the sister defence. Can you ring your sister then? Yeah. She's not got a phone on I thought you wanted to ring her earlier. Yeah, I said I'm waiting for her. Right. The situation is simple. Produce a sister or the car's getting seized. Just, the, the drama is there's only your sister and she would to drive this. Yeah. You know, that's, that's where my interest is right now, to kind of get to the bottom of it. Um, if, if you've driven up here without insurance, it's not the end of the world. 
but I'll wait there until your sister arrives. Okay, mate, you'll have to look over here. Mate. Equally, I can have the NPR cameras looked at that will cover the journey from you in this car from wherever you have come at. Yeah. The ones where you are right now are incredible. High definition. Um, if that's only going to show your sister driving, then happy days, you've got nothing to worry about. Yeah. No, but, no, but now's the time to tell me if there was something different to that. What mate, my sister will drive. I, I, I would only sit in a car waiting for it's not going crying, is it? No. Well, Hello. We'll just wait then to make sure. Okay. Hello? I'm sat here doing it all, and the phone's up here for me saying we're going to wait for that. It's but are you, Have you got rights to attempt here? Have you got cars not going with yeah, to prevent you from driving us. Yeah, but I'm not driving, I'm going to go for some toy, I'm being sister. It's a standoff in Peter Lee. Right now there's a there's a suspicion that you two have taken this without your sister's consent. That's what my suspicion is. The guy is sticking to his story. She had become worried to take the fetch the dog. Unfortunately, his mate isn't. Right, is that the crack? That's the, that, that's the crack. What's the crack with that thing? Game over. That's right, it? I've it from. That's, that's game over. You got any right? insurance? No. Believe it or not, this isn't day one for me being a Bobby. You know, been doing this for a long time. I knew that ten minutes ago. His friend wasn't quite as tuned into the story as what he was. You know, and, but I was just playing along with the story and I was going to wait for the sister to turn up. Would have been a long wait, wouldn't it? You know, she wasn't just round the corner getting a bag of chips. The dog selling driver attended court, but the case was discontinued as the courts decided there wasn't sufficient evidence.